Hey y'all, I'm Matt with Coastal Tenting. Welcome to my house. We're getting ready to do something that's pretty cool and I think you'll like to check it out. Going to be doing an impact test on the security window film that I've installed on the sliding glass doors in my own home. Now I've always wanted to do this but I've never had anybody that's either brave enough or stupid enough to volunteer their home and well here I am. So what we're going to be doing is hurling well this rock for one into the sliding glass door to demonstrate to you the impact resistance of these safety and security films. Now this rock weighs about two and a half pounds and as you're going to see it's, it creates a really violent impact. Now this is similar to a situation that you'd see if somebody's either trying to break into your home but also in, in this coastal area we're always worried about hurricanes and in a hurricane you have a lot of debris that's blowing around what they call windborne debris and that is typically what breaks your windows in a storm. Now this rock will be simulating something that's a pretty big hunk of debris. Now, what we can expect to see in this brake test is the exterior pane of glass, which is unprotected, is going to explode once it's hit by this rock. The film is on the inside surface of the glass and is designed to hold that broken glass together. So you're going to see the film holding that interior pane together and you should expect to see these rocks bouncing off of them. Now we have two different types of installation here. It's the same 8mm multiply film on both panels. However, only one panel has what we call a wet glaze frame attachment. And that involves around the perimeter of the window, a structural sealant that links the film to the frame. And upon repeated impacts, again, as you will see, we expect that the wet glaze frame attachment will offer significant protective benefits relative to the other panel where the film is only trimmed to the exposed opening. All right, y'all, we're doing this. Boys, let's break some glass. Greg, here's your rock. Scotty, you've got yours. Remember, this is my house. Please only hit the glass, but let's get violent. Okay, y'all, that was violent and awesome and epic. So what we learned here was that the non-frame attached panel, which as you might be able to guess was this one, did significantly worse upon multiple impacts as compared to the window where the film was bonded to the frame. It only took two impacts for the non-frame attached panel to give way. Whereas here we have the frame attached panel that's still intact, still in frame, Still held together. This is what we expected. This is why we do the frame attachment, and this is why you should insist that the frame attachment be included at any time you use security window film. All right, y'all, here we are. We've just officially destroyed my house, so I hope you enjoyed that. 
But I wanted to point out something and show you this is certainly not a rigged test. Now, the rock that made it through the non-attached panel is all the way by the garage door. So again, it demonstrates why we do the frame attachment, why you should insist on the frame attachment, and do not trust anybody who tells you it need not be done. Thanks so much.